This video is sponsored by Squarespace. From websites and online stores to marketing tools and analytics, Squarespace is the all-in-one platform to build a beautiful online presence and run your business. Stay tuned at the end of this video to find out how you can save 10% on your first purchase of Squarespace. So I made a poll on my Instagram asking you guys, do you want Lifeline next or do you want Caustic next? And to my surprise, a vast majority of you guys really wanted Caustic. So here you go. If this is not what you wanted, then maybe you should go on my Instagram and vote. For years, I've been trying to come up with the perfect formula for the smelliest thing in the world. And yesterday I discovered it. And now I can introduce to you the worst smelling thing in the world. Some people would call me an artist but I much rather would call myself a fartist. You see the re- What the heck was that? So what do you think, pretty good? We are a pesticide company. You told me to make the most toxic gas of all time. Why would we use farts on bugs? What's worse than farts? Does that even kill bugs? I don't believe you smell the fart this bad. I'm not gonna smell your farts. You're fired. You're gonna try to fire me, huh? Okay, suit yourself. What are you doing? It smells really bad! Oh! <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> Cossack's real name is Alexander Knox. He was a scientist who worked for Humbert Labs, a pesticide company. Knox developed some of the best pesticides, but he wanted living test subjects. And uh, he wasn't talking about rats, he was talking about people. The head of Humbert Labs caught wind of this and was like, uh, no. But Knox blew him up and blew up the factory and maybe himself, he was presumed dead for a while. And of course he wasn't because Cossack showed up in the Apex games. Now he has test subjects in the form of the other living contestants. But I mean, he's doing it all for the name of science so it can't be that bad. Just kidding, this man is crazy evil, man. I mean, listen to his voice lines. I feel most alive when rapidly approaching my death. Life is meant to die. Accept your fates. Wait a second, that voice sounds familiar. But now that you know who Kostik is, let's learn how to play him, shall we? Ineptitude is the true killer. Caustic's main ability is his gas traps, full of his patent pending Nox gas. If an enemy is near his gas traps, they will activate and it will damage opponents for 4 damage a second while slowing them down and they can't see through the smoke. You can carry up to 3 of these bad boys and they will slowly recharge. Your team won't take any damage from the gas, but they will be slowed and blinded still, so warn them before you start tooting in the room. So you can imagine it's pretty annoying to deal with, but that's kind of the point of Caustic. It's to be as toxic as possible. Enemies will die from your toxic gas, and teammates will die from your non-stop toxicity online. There's a robot next to you, hard solution. On your left, there's a robot. Left the to top, on your right, no, turn around. Left. Nope, other left. There. <laughs> now, Caustic's traps aren't this unstoppable force. If one is in the way, you can just shoot it on the bottom and boom, it's gone. But if it's already active, all your enemy can do is leave or die in the gas. Seriously though, just the sight of a gas canister will make enemies get the heck out of there. Nope, not dealing with that brother. The cool part is you can set off your own traps by shooting them. So in my Watson video, I mentioned that Watson was the queen of camping and Caustic is definitely the king of camping. Are people trying to come into your room? Big mistake. Put those traps down, son. What's that? Your teammate needs to be revived? Put a trap down and safely resurrect this weak fool. Whoa, Macro, that's toxic. See, you get it. But just remember, you can only have six traps at a time. So don't be just throwing traps willy nilly. You gotta know where they are. As I mentioned before, your teammates won't take any damage and they can't see through the gas either. But you, on the other hand, you can actually see inside your own Nox gas and you're unaffected by other caustics. So uh, screw your team, be toxic and gas it up. Now caustic is a big boy. I mean, look at him. Thick boys camping in the corner of the world. He's not swole, he's cost thick. So Apex felt bad because him and Gibby had these thick hitboxes and gave them both reduced damage. Yep, that means it'll take more than a couple bullets to take me down. Respawn, why am I so cost thick? I want to be cost thin. Please cost think about it next patch. 
Caustic's ultimate is the Nox nade. He basically takes a gas trap canister, tapes it to a grenade, and then bada bing bada boom, that's his ultimate. This ultimate is what allows Caustic boys to play more offensively. Your Nox gas can be thrown into a room or directly on enemies to cause chaos, and you can get easy kills. What's that? Someone's trying to heal? That's nice. Nox! People in the middle of a fight? Oh wow, that's so cool. Nox! Dang, I just knocked two whole squads out. Get it? Get knocked? It's like a play on words. Basically, this forces enemies to play way differently. In combination with your traps, you can force an enemy to go one direction where you can line up an easy kill. That was easy. Or you can even accidentally catch an invisible mirage. Mirage, more like he raged. <laughs> This ultimate is a must, so take Lifeline's ultimate accelerants away from her and get your own ultimate. MY ULTIMATE'S BETTER THAN YOURS! You know I'm the most toxic man on the internet, and I'm arguably the thickest. So by the law of disproportion solitariness, I'm the greatest caustic main, period. So listen to these dank tips. Number one, use traps to block doors. This can guarantee a res for your team, or can trap enemies inside. Being unable to open doors is already a strong tool, but paired with gas, <laughs> it's pretty strong. Number two, caustic pairs well with Watson and Gibby or Lifeline. With Watson, you can camp an entire room and no one can even stop you. It's it's genuinely broken, especially in the late game. But Caustic also does pretty well alone because all of the downsides of his gas, they don't exist in solos. He's pretty solid in solos for that reason. Don't believe me? Well, Twitch doesn't lie. Shameless plug. Breathe it in. We won! Number three. Speaking of late game, you gotta trap up the final circle. This forces enemies to either waste time destroying traps or they have to fight in the gas. Tip number four. Since Caustic is way better indoors, you're gonna wanna land somewhere that is mostly indoors, like the bunker, cause bunker or no thunker. Bunker boys, bunker party, bunker boys, bunker party, bunker boys. Before Costa got his buff that made it so he can take less damage, he was honestly not that great. However, right now, I think Caustic is one of the better characters to use. Now his hitbox is enormous, and that makes him kind of a bullet sponge, but if you play him correctly like a tank, creating space for your teammates, he is honestly one of the best characters in the game currently. I do wish that there was a way to tell between your gas and enemy's gas. Sometimes your teammates will walk into gas not knowing it's an enemy's and be like, what the heck, I thought this was yours! And I kind of wish there was a clear color difference. For example, if it's your gas, it should be like blue or something, and if it's the enemy's gas, it should be green. That's just my two cents. But besides that, I do think that Caustic is pretty solid, and for noobs, he's like a medium character to play. He's not too difficult to use, but with enough practice, you can become really good with him. But what do you guys think? Do you think Caustic is easy to play, hard to play? Do you think he needs buffs? Do you think he needs nerfs? Let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to join my Discord and join the Thick Familia. We're almost at 3,000 people in the Discord. It's a lot of fun, I think. Okay guys, in this video I'm pretty toxic, so I'm not even gonna sugarcoat it. Ya noobs should listen to a word from our sponsor. Squarespace. Squarespace is the all-in-one platform to build a beautiful online presence and run your business. Whether you're running a blog, a t-shirt website, or you just want to make a website just for memes, it doesn't matter what you do with it, Squarespace is the place. Squarespace is so easy to use, you can make your own beautiful, unique website. You can even purchase your own unique domain through Squarespace. So if you have that specific domain name like funnymacroboy.com and it's not taken, you might want to get it now before it's gone. And after you make your website, there's this awesome traffic overview that allows for you to see who visits your website. And you can kind of adjust your website accordingly if you want to target a different audience. And now they got complete commenting features, which allows for people to comment, reply, and even like stuff on your website. So if you haven't tried Squarespace yet, try your first month for free. And if you really like it and you want to buy it, you can save 10% off your first purchase by using the code macro or clicking the link down below. Don't let your domain be taken away. Use Squarespace today. Oh, <laughs> that rhymed. Awesome. Thank <laughs> you.